Thanks, Kristen. June is National Dairy Month, and we took the opportunity to visit a Brazos Valley dairy that's been in the four generations in the making. Shell Winkley has more in this week's From the Ground Up. The Lear Dairy moved its operation a little north of Franklin in 1974. I like the lifestyle. In a dairy, dairy farm, the way we put it up, you also did farming, you raised cows. There was always something to do. In fact, there was too much to do. I like working hard. I guess I was never built to sit in the office. And that's good because their dairy is a fully integrated operation that uses the manure and wastewater produced to then fertilize and grow the grain and forage to feed their cows. We brought it to them. We brought the corn sauce to them. We brought the hay to them. Mixed the feed with it, and we all feed. We feed everything outside here now. So all the requirements are all met right here. This this has a different ration than this and on this side here. The cow's comfort is goal number one. Most are milked three times a day. They got to be happy here, and you know we got fans and sprinklers running on them. That helps out during the summertime like that, and then the wintertime it's nice and cool in here. The more comfortable they are, the more milk you'll get. This is like any other business. You take care of the things that make you money. And aside from the hard work, why are dairy numbers decreasing? The main thing is the price, because you couldn't hardly. I mean, uh, a couple of years ago, it was really bad. We was losing money, you know, every day. The more cows you had, the more you were losing, what it boiled down to. But last year was a record year. It was the best year we ever had. What about the disconnect with consumers? I guess because we live in a world of right now. You don't understand what it takes. It takes time and a lot of work to make a gallon of milk. Not to mention dedication to your work. There's no Christmas off. Somebody's always got to be here. If you got days off, you come up here. <laughs> it's just the way it is. I'm Shell Winkley, looking at Central Texas agriculture from the ground up. From the Ground Up is brought to you by Producers Cooperative, proudly serving agriculture since 1943.